Well, New Jersey-based Catalan is within days of opening the first piece of a major expansion at its Bloomington operation. Since acquiring the site from Cook Pharmaca about five years ago, Catalan has poured some $500 million into the facility. Business of Health reporter Kylie Valletta has more. Kylie. Thank you, Gary. This most recent expansion is a $350 million investment and is expected to create 1,000 jobs. Catalan's work in manufacturing the COVID vaccines helped spur the growth. The company expanded for the Johnson & Johnson vaccine, again for the Moderna vaccine, and now a third growth spurt that relates to a variety of projects. And joining me now to tell us more about this most recent expansion is Andrew Espejo, General Manager at Catalan Bloomington. Hi, Andrew. Welcome to the show. Hi, Kylie. Thank you for having me. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So let's talk about the expansion in just a minute. But first, um, give us a quick refresher on Catalan and the work that it does there in Bloomington. Sure. Thank you, Kylie. Catalan is a contract development manufacturing organization. We have a global presence. And here in Bloomington, uh, we support over 160 molecules that we manufacture for over 65 clients, 18 of which are uh, some of the top biopharmaceutical companies in our industry. Um, we support uh, our medications, support over 35 indications across infectious disease, oncology, cardiovascular disease, inflammatory disease. 80% uh, of the uh, products that we manufacture are biologics, and our site has won multiple ISPE, in, uh, the International Society of Pharmaceutical Engineers uh, Facility of the Year Awards. Recently, uh, just this uh, uh, past spring, we won the Facility of the Year Award for our, our new facility here, affectionately known as Building C. All right, let's talk about the expansion, $350 million. What new capabilities will it give you? Sure, this $350 million expansion or investment will add additional drug substance, drug product, um, fill finish capabilities, our secondary packaging, uh, and our quality control labs. Essentially, we'll be building out uh, more capacity uh, with the, for the capabilities we currently have on site. And this is, will all serve to grow the, the demand that the industry has for biologic development and for, for manufacturing. Uh, Specifically, these uh, these expansion, this advancement will include um, two bioreactors, two syringe filling lines, um, packaging lines, syringe inspection machines, freezers, cartoning machines, auto injector device assembly, and like I said, the quality, the expansion of our quality control capabilities. All right, let's talk about talent. One thousand jobs, not a lot of uh, expansion announcements come with that kind of number. What are your thoughts on talent? I know you're in progress hiring some of those positions. So, um, is it tough? How's it going? It, it, it's in our environment today. It's not easy, but we are making very good progress. Uh, we have a, a great talent acquisition teams, both here at the site and our corporate headquarters, uh, sponsoring job fairs, um, researching, uh, finding candidates, both within Monroe County in the Bloomington area and without. Uh, we offer great competitive salaries. Um, we also do a lot of work with the universities to bring co-ops and interns in our, in our hire to develop programs you know, grow that talent within uh, within uh, the, the four walls of Catalan. Uh, it, it is a challenge at times, um, but we're, we're seeing very good progress and we continue to work hard to attract that great talent to this area. Yeah, a lot of challenges for a lot of people hiring out there right now. Andrew Espejo, General Manager at Catalan Bloomington, congratulations on the growth and thank you for being on the show today. Thank you very much, Kylie. Appreciate it. Have a great afternoon.